Ariana Grande, Michael Jackson, Christina Aguilera, Beyonce, Madonna, and much more. Today, we're gonna show you how to recreate these iconic looks. But first, make sure you show us some love by subscribing, hitting the notification bell, and clicking the thumbs up button if you liked this video. Ready, fashionistas? Let's start with Ariana Grande's mirror top. Get a black bra and some mirror cardboard pieces. Cut into these shapes. Starting at the center, glue the pieces directly to the bra. Follow this pattern. Trim away any excess. Now for the cups. Fan out the pieces from the underwire like you see here. Do the straps. Then fill in any gaps with smaller pieces. Totally gorgeous! To get that Michael Jackson blazer look, start with a black blazer from a thrift store. Take a strand of gold rope and glue it in a loop. Braid the four strands under the loop like this. Wrap a gold squiggly ribbon around the base of the braided rope. Next, cut a bunch of strands of gold ribbon. Lay them out across the front of the jacket and hot glue them in place. Add some gold confetti stars, clustering them around the ends of the ribbon. Glue your gold ropes at the tops of the shoulders. Add four clusters to the cuff of each sleeve. Glue a wide gold ribbon diagonally across the front of the jacket, and your iconic Michael Jackson blazer is complete. To get Beyonce's notorious glove look, start with a cotton glove. Cut a section out of the back above the cuff line. Then glue on pieces of your mirrored cardboard. Start with long pieces for the cuff around the hole. Then add smaller square pieces for the rest of the glove. Try the glove on to make it easier. When it's done, everyone will want to put a ring on it. Can you guess what this next look will be? Here's a hint. We're starting with this white lace shirt. Cut the sleeves off and sew the lace to a piece of white ribbon. Next, cut the bottom part off the shirt and a lace section from the back and glue it to the front of a plain white bra. Use a ruler to press the lace down so you don't burn yourself. Now, take the bottom part of the shirt and glue it to the bottom of the bra. Print out a statement on a piece of paper and stick it to the back of a piece of mirrored cardboard and cut out the letters with an X-Acto knife. Times have changed since the 80s, so maybe girl power would be a better phrase. No offense, Madonna. Glue your phrase to a belt. Then, cut out a bunch of white felt hearts for the skirt. Let's turn these colorful suspenders into a garter belt for the waist. Gather and tuck some white toll to the inside of the belt. And glue on those pretty little hearts. When you put it all together, you've got this amazing outfit. This look is ageless. Mm -hmm. 
Lady Gaga's poker face mask is super easy to make. Check it out. You just need a plain mask from the dollar store and some mirrored cardboard. Mark a bunch of medium sized and small squares to the back of the mirrored cardboard. Cut out the squares and paste them onto the mask. Place the medium squares above the eyes, here. Put the smaller squares in between. Then glue the smaller squares in this pattern under the eyes. Now you've got a disco ball mask just like the one in Lady Gaga's Poker Face video. For this next look, you're going to need felt fabric. Trace the shape of a bodysuit onto a piece of gray felt. Add extra humps at the top and cut it out. Now, add these felt cutouts of ears, eyes, and a mouth with a tongue sticking out. Glue the felt pieces in place and add little details to the tongue and eyes with a black marker. Then, glue the felt piece to your bodysuit. Now, you can look just like Miley Cyrus. To rock the Christina Aguilera look, trace these lines along a white t-shirt, from the center of the collar to the bottom of the armpit. Cut it out, leaving the collar neckline in place. Then trace and cut out these slits from the bottom of the shirt. Then stick silver studs over the shirt. That's all there is to it to get this look inspired by Christina Aguilera. Okay, grab a pillow and get ready to have fun. Pull the pillowcase off and turn it inside out. Then stick some toy stuffing to the inside of the pillowcase with spray adhesive. When you're done, flip the pillowcase right side out. Seal it, shut with spray adhesive. Then grab a strip of white ribbon, cinch the pillowcase in the center, and secure the ribbon around it to make an oversized bow. Put it on your head by attaching it to a headband. This T-Swift outfit is a piece of cake. Just print out this phrase onto some paper and size it up to fit a plain white t-shirt. Cut out the letters and put a piece of cardboard inside the shirt so the paint doesn't bleed through. Place the stencil on the front of the shirt. Then sponge on some black fabric paint. Sponge the paint on all the letters in the phrase. Once the paint dries, try it on with your hat and red hard frame sunglasses for the complete Taylor Swift look. Thanks for watching Crafty Hackers. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more crafty hacks and ideas. See you later!